Alrighty. Yeah! <laughs> it's so exciting. Pretty neat. You like it? Pretty it neat. Take a lot of work. Super spacious. Super, super spacious. Look how much stuff they left, though. They this, left this, this is for all science. trash, huh? No, this I can use for science. Oh, that's pretty neat. Yeah, that's awesome. Oh, that's so dope. Yeah, I can put my own. Got some free stuff up in here. Filters. Or whatever that is. Yeah, some air filters. Extremely spacious. Look how much room it's here. So how does it feel going from employment to business owner? Amazing. Within a year, literally. Amazing. Un años, right? Un año. Un año. I can't reach these. We'll break with a bat. Why do we have to break them? We can paint them white. Maybe it's a safe. Maybe it's some money in here. A modem. Thank you. Modem. More free stuff. How about the other one? More free stuff. Lights. I'm not sure what this is exactly. Some hardware stuff for cabinets. Okay. I'm not sure what this crap is. But can this come off and be painted? Another painted? modem. I'm sorry, that's the wrong person. <laughs> we'll need to figure it out. So you want to explain what's going on here? Yes, so this is officially the D. Simon Music Studio place. Right. We, um... We're planning to have this open the first week of January, have a grand opening, and have everybody start coming here. So cool. this will be the office space. What's your occupation exactly? Um, I have my occupation, well, I'm a music teacher. However, I'm a business owner, and I have uh, degrees in music. So I have a master's degree in music performance and a master's degree in a music business administration. So what, so what is your current occupation exactly? What's What's... Uh, well, I, I'm a business owner. Isn't that an occupation? I mean, so you teach stu students piano yeah, lessons, French and voice. Yeah, I teach how to play music, how to there you play go. piano, how to sing, music appreciation, and everything music. And, you, and you're, you're doing that how and what way exactly, teaching people? like Well, what? right now, I'm doing mobile, meaning I'm traveling from home to other people's homes mm -hmm. so I can teach them. And right. now we're transitioning into a studio because... Um, I can no longer accept new students because I'm completely capped out. So we got a studio, that way we have more room for new students. So this is going to be where you're going to teach students, yeah, basically. this is going to be the studio. There you go. We heard it live here. You're this right, is me. her official studio to teach human beings how to sing, play piano, and horns. This is super spacious. Isn't it too big? No, I think it's just what you need. More space. I mean, the piano's going to take a while. The piano's going to take this Where, Where's it? It's, it's going to be right here? Yeah. Wow. The piano's going to be here. That wall is going to be a different color, so mm -hmm. it's not going to be covered with anything. The couch, my goal is in the table to be over here. Um, over here somewhere will be like a coffee station. I'm planning not to cover the mirrors with anything because I need the mirrors. Awesome. So when does this place open up exactly? We don't have an exact date based off on the city needs to approve business tax um, and all that stuff. As soon as we have it all figured out and all painted and looking nice, then we... Okay. As we said before... The start of New Year's here. As we said before, this is her new studio to teach students piano, voice, and horn. D. Simon Music. Any more information you would like, feel free to contact you where exactly? So you can email us at info at dsimonmusic.com or you can uh, so follow us on social media at D. Simon Music on Facebook and on Instagram. How do you spell that exactly? Sorry. D-E-E -E Simon, S-I-M-O-N. Uh, or you can follow us on there, contact us on there, or you can always call or text 321-265-0173. We also offer virtual lessons, so even if you're in California or in Utah, you can still take classes from Florida. There you go. So, camera on me now. So what I plan on doing is basically document her journey as a business owner. That is going to be the plan for this YouTube channel and social media in general. We're gonna document this entire journey, like I said before, so you're gonna see pictures of like before and after pictures of the studio. 
you're gonna see us work and rip this thick ass wallpaper off this wall. This is some thick wallpaper. And I don't know jack ish about paint. Well, sandpaper and ripping thick. It's not just some regular, like, this is like, like thick, man. Like, damn. I, so if you have any tips, advice, how to rip wallpaper off conveniently, quick, um, leave a comment down below. All that good stuff because, yeah, we need your help. Yeah, so um, that's what we're going to be doing, document the entire journey, before and after. You're going, I'm not sure if uh, parents are uh, filming students' faces. I'm not sure that's... Yeah, some parents, yes. Yeah, so we're not, we're not going to do that. Um, no, we'll, we'll get videos and stuff on, on social media from students, so okay. some parents do a lot of that. Okay, so that's cool. I'll just draw out the faces. There's no issues. But like I said before, this is her new joint, her new studio. That's what we're gonna do. You mind about start posting on social media? No. On your right. social media? Whatever. Just the fact that this is your new place. This is your That's new studio. All right. So she's on the phone with her parents. Just to, uh, you know, she's happy. She's excited. This is exciting. So listen, like I said before, this is gonna be the plan for this YouTube channel. Um, we're just gonna document the journey of her having this place. Um, show you some before and after pictures. We're gonna show us building it, painting it, um, bringing this new furniture, all that good stuff. I'm excited, she's excited. And um, yeah, this is why I'm so really big on filming stuff like this, just document about interracial couples. Um, life is great, you know. I'm not sure what to say besides that. It feels good being married. I don't know why this is still a thing in society of, you know, skin color. I'm not trying to change the subject, but skin color is still a thing for most people. So I'm hoping videos like this can just change the mind of some individuals where you're not, you're going to let stuff like skin color stop you from meeting people, meeting new friends, um, building relationships, networking. It shouldn't be about skin color every day. Every day. It shouldn't be about, it shouldn't be about skin color at all. It should not be about that at all in 2022 2023 really so i love my wife i'm excited for her we love life our realtor is awesome she's like a sweetheart i just met her today she's like the bomb um we met the agent i'm not sure what he was exactly but he was just super cool i think he's the i'm not sure what's the proper name i'm so sorry but there's a realtor there's another person that's who i met that's who he is cool dude super cool dude so yeah I'm pretty much done talking. Got some crap here in the background. Got some free stuff. Some signs and you know, leaves and stuff up. Um, hey, careful. I don't know why you keep sitting. Super, super awesome. So, yeah. That's it with this video. Much love to you. Be safe out there. Catch you on the next episode. And, yeah, this is going to be what I'm going to document. The journey of her business. Peace out. Have an awesome day. Happy 2023. Peace out.